It's like there's so many people starving in the third world, then like, why is tidying my room such a big deal? And she says, where are you going? What are you doing? How long are you going to be? Are you going down the shops? If you are, can you pick up my ointment or whatever? And I'm saying to her, I said, Mother, for heaven's sake, I'm 43 years old. Leave me alone. And I want to maybe say that you've married me under false pretenses because I can distinctly remember that when we got married, I thought we were going to have a sex life and we can have a great sex life for the rest we of our lives together. We can have a sex life. We're just not youngsters anymore. We, we, we don't need to throw each other in the bed. We don't need to so do it. So now you're like... telling me that my body's gone saggy and I'm old and I can't actually have sex anymore because no, I'm not I'm a youngster. I'm not saying that. You really do know how you to make me feel better, don't you? You've got a beautiful body. It's like I've got so much stuff going on inside and no one understands me. I'm actually writing a song about it. And she hides the remote control. Now I ask you, what sort of woman is that? I mean, for heaven's sake, I swear to God, next year I'm putting her in that nursing home. Look, all I'm saying is that once a week would be nice. What, are you saying we don't you... have good time together? I all I know is you talk. come home and you want to talk. You don't want to do what we used to do on Friday night. And death seems like a warm embrace and the thought of your smile and the thought of your face. So I whispered in this girl's ear, fittest girl I've ever seen. Easiest fuck ever. I love drunk girls. Yes. Watch this, watch this. What is it? Wait. Oh! oh. Wait, watch, 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 oh. watch. Oh. Mate, I can't even watch that. It's that nice. Grim. No, it's I like nice. it. There you go. So we all know it. We should go on holiday again. Yeah, Napa. definitely. Yeah, Napa was amazing. Napa was sick. Remember Toke, you're a pretty fit girl. <laughs> yeah, of course, mate. Yeah, yeah right. So he says. Oh, shut up, mate. How many birds do you get with him? At least four. Oh, look. Oh, what are you talking it's about? Bullshit. Even Leon had have more than that, and he was in his room all the time, just moping around. No, I wasn't. Yeah, you were. Yeah. Fuck off. Of course you were, mate. Were you even there? In your room all the time. Didn't do anything. So what do later then, guys? Lollipop. I don't want to talk about Chinese food anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I do. I'm really hungry. <laughs> yeah, I'd like, I'd like a uh, Indian instead of that. You're not ready, mate. So excited. Oh, Oh. I should just say that anything that's said in here is strictly confidential unless you pose a threat to yourself or someone else. <laughs> so then, Leon. I'm not going to top myself. Sorry? All that legal stuff you just said. I'm not going to top myself. You can write that down if you like. Why do you do this job? Like, do you get some sort of pleasure from listening to people's sex lives and pathetic problems? Or would you like to think you're helping people? Actually, I bet you do hate this job. I would. Bet you're sick of hearing people whinging and moaning about their pathetic lives and how unhappy they are. <laughs> okay, that's enough. 
You just sit there drinking between sessions while they pay you to listen to them and you don't even give a shit. So that's enough. Hey, hey, John and Matt, what's happening? Nah, I'm at work, mate. Sounds quiet. Yeah, I'm just in Jay's office. Yeah, we've got a problem here. You coming? Yeah, right. See you tonight. Bye. What? I don't know, it could have lasted about 10, 20 minutes or something. This heavy breathing, do you get it when you're at work? Yeah. Well, go on then. Analyse me. Tell me it stems from my childhood or I'm some sort of manic depressive or something. <laughs> it's not quite as easy as that. Well, what is it then? You're having panic attacks, Leo. And these can happen for a number of reasons. Panic attacks? I was just doing the washing up. Do you have a girlfriend, someone you could be intimate with? There's always girls. But that's got nothing to do with it. Do you feel lonely? I don't know. Just feel sick. Seeing people with their happy lives and relationships. Why don't I have that? Why do I feel like shit every day when I wake up? We've made good progress here, Leo. I think we need to talk about your relationships. Try and find out why these panic attacks are happening. Well, time's nearly up, so... Well, I'll see you next week.